Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. So hope everyone is fine. On that note, let's start this video. So friends, for the past five years we are giving the solutions for NPTEL courses. So last time also we have given the machine learning course solutions. So guys, uh, we have also prepared exam preparation MCQs, guys. So I want to tell you from the first video itself. So in order to familiarize with you, so we have bought this, brought this to you. So we have collected previous year MCQs guys, assignment MCQs, so introduction to machine learning course. So we will provide the PDF version guys, so through a Google Drive link and with this you can get nearly 600 plus MCQs guys. So which is mo way more than the other subjects we are providing, we will provide 600 plus MCQs for just 500 only guys. So no one in, in this YouTube is providing that guys, only our channel is doing that, completely NPTEL based syllabus guys. So what are the benefits of this PDF? So let's see that. So for this 500 rupees uh, PDF uh, Google Drive link access, you can get 600 plus previous assignment MCQs, which covers many topics. And also the second one is, you can get access till the exam day, not uh, one week, not one month or not two months, till the exam day, you can get that guys. And you can get access up to five members, not for, this 500 is not for one person guys. So up to five members can use this uh, PDF version, so that you can send me uh, five emails who for whom the access should be needed. So five members combinedly you can give 500 guys. So it will be very useful for your classmates who are doing the same course and friends also. And also in the PDF there is search uh, option guys, so that you can easily easily search questions using certain keywords related to that question guys. And it is easy to re revise before exam because you can easily scroll the PDF along with the explanations, right? So you can search the keywords and you can search the PDF, right? So you'll get 600 plus MCQs, guys. No one is providing this much amount of MCQs for this less price. So up to five members can access this by using the same amount 500 only, no extra charge. So if you want this, you can mail me at uh, the mail I have given, guys. So here you can see the mail. So you can mail me at, so for this mail guys, so you can mail me here to this mail. So if you want to buy this pack, then please ma mail me at this bk1794714 at red gmail.com guys. So please uh, give me your subject as machine learning. So and then I will uh, give the UPI ID guys so that you can pay that. So after that I will add you to the Google link access guys. So if you have any doubts please ask me in the comment section and if you want to buy then only please mail to the email guys. So we are providing the genuine solutions and most probable solutions for the past 5 years guys you can check our videos. So that's it guys now let's see the solutions. So please share this information across your college and your classroom guys. So up to 5 members you can get the access for this 500 only no extra charge. So now let's see the assignment 1 solutions. So guys please watch the video till the end because if I change any solutions you may miss that. So do watch full video. So first question regarding week 1 assignment of introduction to machine learning course. So first one, which of the following is a supervised learning problem? So for first question, uh, there are three probable solutions guys. The first one is, second option, predicting credit approval based on historical data. And next, it is third option, predicting if a new image has cat or dog based on the historical data of the other images of cats and dogs, where you are supplied the information about which image is cat or dog. So second one and the other one is third option guys. So third option also. So last three options are the probable solutions for first question. Guys, if you feel there should be any change in the solution, please give your suggestion in the comment section. So, we'll try to sort it out. But I hope almost every solution is 100% correct. So, now let's see the second question. Second one. Which of the following are classification problems? So, for second question, there are again three correct answers. That is, predict which team will win a tournament. Next one, predict whether it will rain today Today, and the other one is predict your mood tomorrow. So last three options are the probable solutions for second question also guys. 
now let's move on to the third one third question which of the following is a regression task regression task so i'll zoom this for your a uh, clear vision guys so third question here you can see that right so for third question there are two solutions the first one is first option itself predicting the monthly sales of a cloth store in rupees and the other one is third option predicting the confirmation probability so first and third option are the probable solutions now so okay now let's move on to the fourth question which of the following is an unsupervised learning task unsupervised learning task so for fourth question there are once again uh, two options the first one group audio files based on language of the speakers and the second one is the second option itself group applicants to a university based on their nationality so these two are the probable solutions for fourth question now let's move on to the fifth one fifth question so fifth one which of the following is a categorical feature which of the following is a categorical feature feature so for fifth question there are three solutions once again the first one is gender of a person so that we can classify right i mean categorize right so fifth for fifth question option 2 and next one fourth option ethnicity of a person and the other one is the color of the curtains in your room so these three are the probable solutions for fifth question guys now let's move on to the sixth one so sixth one which of the following is a reinforcement learning task so for sixth question there are two solutions the first one is option a learning to drive a cycle and the other one is learning to play chess learning to play chess so these two are the probable solutions for sixth question so guys please do share this with your friends and classmates guys and regarding this membership i mean uh, the pdf pack also so keep this in your whatsapp status or please share with your whatsapp groups so that make most of your classmates join in our channel and also uh, buy this pack so that it will benefit for you in the learning process so you can we are giving nearly 600 plus mcqs guys this much amount of mcqs you cannot find outside so get it as early as possible guys so you can get the access till the exam day from now and also for each 500 you pay you'll get access up to five members five gmail address five usernames so up to five people can watch uh, get the access for till the exam day for this 500 only guys so for 500 up to five members can get that that means for each person it is taking just 100 rupees only right so now let's see the once again see the solutions seventh question let x and y be a uniformly distributed random variable over the interval 0 4 and 0 6 so respectively so if x and y are independent events then compute the probability p max x comma y greater than 3 so for seventh question the correct answer is last but one option guys 5 by 8 5 by 8 now let's move on to the eighth question find the mean 0 0 to 1 loss for the given predictions so for eighth question the correct answer is the fourth option guys 0.5 the mean is 0.5 now let's move on to the ninth one ninth question so which of the following statements are true so for ninth question guys here i got uh, two probable solutions the first one is option b and the other one is fourth option second option and fourth option guys if you feel there should be any changes to be made please give your suggestion in the comment section but i hope every solution is almost correct so if you have any doubts regarding this please ask me in the comment section 
now let's move on to the final question of the assignment guys that is 10th question bias and variance are given by so for this the correct answer is first option so mark first option as correct answer for 10th question guys so friends these are the solutions for week 1 assignment of introduction to machine learning course so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and share this with your friends guys and make uh, make sure that you will share that within your whatsapp groups of your college and also uh, consider this guys so you will get pdf version of google drive link for just 500 only guys for each 500 up to 5 members can get access till the exam day guys that means for each person it takes only 100 rupees right so you have to buy that in bulk guys so for 5 members it will take 500 rupees and you will get more than 600 plus mcqs guys so keep that in mind and also you have the search option available so that you can easily search the questions right so and, in, and it also easy to revise before the exam once you go to the exam center before that you can revise that guys so there are a lot of benefits with this pdf version guys so hope you do this and please message me at bk179417 at red gmail.com so if you want to buy this pack message here guys so if you have any doubts regarding this you can ask me in the youtube comments itself only if you want to buy that you have you can message to this email guys so that's it guys for this video so until the next video goodbye thank you